Welcome back, survivors. Disturb Z here, and we are back in How to Survive 2. Let's see. We are going to go explore a little bit. We're going to go up here and see... See that old dude up here. Over by the swamp. See if he has any quest for us to do. Now... I had a little bit of issue with the game yesterday. Well, not necessarily the game, but... Did like I normally do. Make up a video for y'all guys. And I upload it to YouTube. Well. Lo and behold, YouTube decided that... The howling wind... From the city... Was... Copyrighted. Now, I don't know what the deal is with that. I sent in a ticket to the How to Survive people over at 505 Games. And since it being the weekend, I'm not expecting to hear back from them until Monday, maybe even Tuesday. At the earliest. Now, I don't know if they sourced out some of their sounds and it was, you know, one of those we bought a sound but we don't actually own the rights to it. Or if this song, I say it's a song, it's some janky little, oh, I don't even remember what it was called, but it was, it was pathetic. It really was. I uh, don't care for the music at all. Um... It was horrible in my opinion, but it had this howling wind effect at the very beginning that sounded identical to the howling wind in the city yesterday. So, I got a ID claim on the video, so I had to mute like a 30-40 second section of my video. Not too happy with that, but we will see how it plays out. Because if it turns out that 505 Games has control of the, the sound effects, the wind howling, and I got an unfair claim, I am going to dispute it, guys. But, that's enough of that. Let's get on to a mission... Let's do this Warring Brothers mission. Let's see what that's about. Alright, here we go. I'm talking about my brother, and I'm running him down. I know, but he deserves it. Ma would roll over in her grave if she saw it. If she was dead, of course. Roscoe and me were always real close when we were kids. We shared everything. We did everything together, even when we went out with our sisters or our girlfriends. Now that's just a little bit dirty right there, people. Which we did often enough. Life was good. That's why he's got me so riled now. Plus, I'm kind of worried about him. He hasn't been back in three days. Three days. What with those deals of his, he's always spending time in pretty dangerous places. Sure, with the money he got off those customers of his, he can afford a new set of teeth. But he's going to end up getting himself eaten one of these days. And I'll be the first in line to have a whiz on his grave, believe you me. But for now, you'd be doing me a service if you went to see if he's still in one piece so we can have one last go at each other. He's got to be in the swamp again. Please go take a look. I'd sure be appreciative if you could do that for me. We all need something. All right, well, classic southern swamp people going out with their sisters, hmm, well, not sure what to say about that one, guys, but I can say, if y'all are enjoying the series, be sure to like the video, and if you haven't already, guys, hit that subscribe button for me. I really do appreciate each and every one of y'all's support. 
and we are a growing channel and I am glad to bring y'all more content oh what in the world do we got here we got zombies we got freaking coyotes we got Got all kinds of little critters up in here. Oh, what in the world? Oh, run! Switch to the bat, switch to the bat. Beat them all down. Alright, well. Let's go get our stuff back. I wasn't prepared. Oh, there's another one. I wasn't prepared for that many, uh, Coyotes to come charging at me, honestly. Oh, I didn't want to stick. Well, maybe I did want to stick. Got to make some more arrows here in a second, I think. Oh, there's another zombie. Another one I see over there in the shadows. And another one. What in the world is going on over here? And a coyote. I heard one running. Where'd he go? Or a blue drop flower, I should guess. Alright, got all that done. Let's see here. We only have 17 arrows. I really want to make some more arrows real quick. 37 ought to be good. Let's make up a couple small dressings. There we go. Mmm, simple crossbow bolt. Oh yeah. Alright, let's see what up, oh, there's another zombie. Another Kyo. Got a whole horde coming in on me again, don't I? Alright, well. I got a chocolate bar. I can't really get back in here, huh? Okay, let's see. Where to go, where to go? Um, I guess this way. Yeah, that's the way we gotta go now. Really wish we can get a little bit of a bigger screen here. Or at least a bigger reveal of the screen, I should say. It would not hurt my feelings at all, guys, if we had a bigger view in the screen. Well, what in the world is that? There's a... This is going to be one of those big maps, ain't it? Swamp we go. Yeah, 
yeah, if the little little circle deal or whatever it is that reveals the, the actual screen here. If it was just like an inch bigger on each side and an inch bigger on the bottom of the screen, I think we would probably do fairly well. I know it's to give a little bit of an immersion because you can't see, especially if you're in a swamp. I get that, but... As far as gameplay goes, it does kind of hinder me. I don't know, maybe there's an option or a perk or something that will allow me to uh, increase the size of that. Now that would be nice. I don't know if there's anything like that. But if there is, I certainly would spend some experience points on it, I'll tell you that much. Know, maybe call it like a hunter sight or something like that. I don't know. Let's see, what kind of food do we got? One chocolate bar. You know, we're doing better since we got those perks where we don't get hungry and thirsty as fast, but we are still not in the best places here. Drop you, drop you, oh, there's someone else that wants to come to the party. Okay, let's see here. Okay, I bet you this is his, I bet you this is his bridge. Can we get up on the bridge, please? stuff here. Oh, there's a few more. Okay. Zombie, that's one. Two. Oh, we missed. Let's see, what is this? A stick? A log? Eh, we'll take it. Why not? Might have to turn it into arrows or maybe build a new structure or something. Oh, what's this up here in the corner? Trying to hide in the trees. Oh, got a dog. Stupid dog. Let's see here. Oh, we got dogs, we got coyotes, we got everything on us. Your little distance. Uh, 
That's right, y'all get wrecked. Did I not shoot the dog? Oh, it was that dog. Dog, coyote, same thing. Oh, not again with this crud. That is so messed up. See, if I'm running and I pull my bow back, I shouldn't have to sit there and lock onto a target for that long to get a freaking a good shot off. I already got the full draw on a bow. I mean, I could understand if it was just I barely pulled the bow back. You know, and you had to get a full draw on it, but no, we had a full draw on the bow. Nope. Got me all up on top of zombies again. old vehicle out here. Get out of my swamp. Did Clifton send you? He got himself some minions now. If he's worried too bad, I hope he gets a stomachache. Now that would be a problem. I can always sell him some antacid, only slightly past the ex expiry date. When you see him, tell him I'll come back when he gives me back my darn helmet. He stole it off me so I couldn't go wandering off anymore. And because of him, I got hit hard enough to make a skull ring. To make my skull ring. Alright. Well, dude, we were going to take your corned beef, that's for sure. Now, is he going to get all upset if I pick this lock? If you do, I'll shoot you in the face. My saw. Alright, the quest is completed. I want to check up here in these two little areas real quick, just to kind of get a peek. Get off me, zombie. There's one down here. No, that's, oh, no, there was one. Hit him. I thought it was clear. There's another one chilling down here. See, there wasn't nothing down here. They should have put something down there. Extra weapon or, you know, some food or something. that poochie's butt. Why can't we hit the poochie? Okay, let's go ahead and use a dressing. And is there anything down here? It still goes a little bit further. 
And now there's nothing. Can we walk through the water? No. I can't do nothing with that. Let's check down in here real quick. Get off me, dog. Okay. And, uh oh, jackpot. Get off me. See, now that's what I'm talking about. Have a little area full of medicinal herbs and coyotes. Why did they have to have coyotes? Okay. Run away. Shoot you. Oh, there's another one. Another one down here, man. <clears throat> Come on, begin hit here. Oh, this is like a really. here. Blackberries. I think we can eat the blackberries. I know we can make them into like a drink. But I'm not really all that concerned over a drink. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You hit me. Man, the stupid coyotes. I think those suckers got a little tougher since the last time. We were killing them. Oh, another zombie on us. Okay, that's just a stick. And where are we at? Another medicinal herb. I think that just about does it. Well, there's some zombies up in there. I really don't like leaving zombies around, guys. You'll notice that in most of the games, I will go to extraordinary measures to eliminate each and every one of them. They're a scum, they're a pest, and I love to destroy them. And we got a chocolate bar. Jackpot. Pow. Alright, we looked at most of it. Well, there's one little spot up here. Let's go check it. Okay, we are back at the bridge. I think we just got another chocolate bar. Alright, let's get out of here. Confirm quest, and let's see what this old boy has to say. Alright. Found Roscoe. How's that fool doing? 
his helmet. Jackass, he ain't getting nothing. He ain't nothing but a child. I don't know what in the Lord's name I did with it. I'll see if I put it with all that junk. But I'm pretty sure I won't find it. Better think of something when that moron won't come back. He's stubborn as a mule. You think you can help me? Alright. Let's see here. What now? The Helmet of Discord. Level 4. Alright guys. Well that's going to do it for today's video. Join us back tomorrow for the next one. But until then, keep on surviving.